today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys a care home that is currently recruiting with visa sponsorship yes the issue of visa sponsorship but please try and watch this video from the beginning to the end so you will understand and know if you qualify for this job you believe in your good life hello beautiful people welcome back again to my youtube channel if today is your first time here my name is Stella. if you've not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for please don't forget don't forget to like subscribe and share my videos click on that notification bell so you get notified whenever i post any new video and for my returning subscriber thank you guys for the love thank you for the support i really do appreciate thank you guys so so much on my channel i talk about my life here in the uk what's happening and i share information so today's video i'm going to be talking about this so nc healthcare uh recruiting i came across this company but before we talk about this company i want to talk about my previous video that i posted i said i contacted this care agency they are recruiting with visa sponsorship on that video few persons told me they contacted the company and they told them to pay money for cos normally you're not meant to pay anything yes you're not meant to pay anything but with what's happening so many persons are paying and i'm not going to advise you to pay or i'm not going to tell you not to pay at the end of the day it's your choice but the only issue i have with that uh person that commented that money that commented on that video said they asked her to pay ten thousand pounds that's a lot that is a lot i'm not even gonna advise anybody to pay ten thousand pounds that is too much to pay there's some kind of small small money they will actually to pay you know that uh, yes this person don't want this company or this agency don't want to use their money you know to pay for to pay for any expenses but then you're coming into the country but paying ten thousand pounds is a lot i'm telling you the truth at the same time i'm going to tell you guys the truth that yes people even inside the uk are paying to get this cos to get um this sponsorship job because it's so competitive some persons that are so desperate will definitely pay because even after their study or whatever you have to pay two thousand plus for your postgraduate isn't it so instead of them you know paying for postgraduates they rather pay for the sponsorship job because you know that with sponsorship job you know that yeah after that you can get your you know indefinite leave to remain but with postgraduates it's not even added to your stay in the country it's not added to anything it's just there so some persons pay so i'm just telling you guys the reality so don't think i'm telling you to pay because me i don't have a i don't have a care company or should i say i don't have any agency company all these uh, videos or all this um care agency we post are just based on research we go online we find that if they recruit with visa sponsorship and then yeah we post it and this nc healthcare said they pay for referral bonus i'm definitely going to contact them to know if i refer people who have the qualification if they're going to pay me for referring if they say yes i'm definitely going to come back here and share with you guys you know the outcome anyways they are currently recruiting with visa sponsorship you can go through it you can see where it says recruitment and it says our international recruitment team have exceptional skills in enable to pair the right people to the right healthcare organization benefiting clients candidate and communicating alike internationally if you are seeking for opportunity to develop your career internationally see a new culture adding international work experience to your resume please give us a call there is shortage of job opportunity in this global workplace so under it you're going to see their contact number and email address so if you're interested in this job you can go through it you see all that you need to know they are licensed and they sponsor visa from overseas at the same time like i told you guys i don't work for any organization so in case they ask you to pay please be careful before paying so you can go click on international recruitment set for the job you want they recruit both nurses doctors healthcare assistant you can mention just go check them out and i believe you're going to see something and the next one we have so this is asa healthcare they also issue visa sponsorship they are licensed organization so if you're looking for visa sponsorship job i think you should also check them out it says caring for your future with dignity our group our group Asa Healthcare is to provide a home for life. Under it, it says Asa Healthcare owns and operates four care homes for people who require accommodation, 
personal and nursing care we provide care for people with dementia as well as people who may require treatment we offer short term respite and long term residential based on a need assessment full 24 hour nursing care is provided so that people can have a home for life our care homes are located in london series so obviously this home is so they are located in london and with what they say you can see the kind of care they provide they provide dementia care for me i feel like dementia is a bit complex so if you're going into this job if it's your first time i think you should make inquiry ask question watch videos you know because whenever you're applying for a job try and know what exactly you know your role is if it's a care home if it's a dementia if it's a complex need like this place they also say people who are sick someone with cancer can be sick and receiving treatment but it can be any type of sickness though and they also say they have recipe recipe is whereby where a client stay for the weekend or for a week go back to their home it's more like when the family need a break then they'll bring their um maybe their grandparent or whoever they're taking care of to recipe home so that is just it they say they have it in london so do check out this care home just type their name on google and send them email at the top is their home about us our care home care all you need to know about this home is just there this is what other is just here, our version the other way our people our homes well you can go check out their homes so you know uh, where about all their homes and see if they have any current vacancy so that you can also apply because to be honest all these homes once they display vacancy before you know people rush them so that's why you need to always check on them even if you apply and they say okay they've gotten enough staff keep checking them there must be vacancy at times goes on not just when you apply once and you feel like oh no this people are not recruiting again no you just need to you know keep checking them so once you go through it you will see all that you need to know this is our home the dimension of the home well this is just like basically what they have in their homes that's just what they are trying to explain there and under it it says Pr proud sponsored so you can see all the people they sponsor they are also supporting british red cross so anyways let's go where they talk about the sponsorship here yeah, they say get in touch with us well that is just it's for you to fill in the form so all these are the benefit for working with them workplace pension scheme training and development within the company refer a friend scheme that's refer and get a bonus on set parking competitive rates paid so here is where you can upload your cv you can see it you can write a message and upload your cv well under it that's where they talk about the sponsorship they said sponsorship available application for tier 2 role who require tier 2 sponsorship to work in the uk will be considered alongside with all application overseas you can see where they say overseas so applicant may not be appointed if a suitable qualified experience and skilled eu or ee candidate is available as mandated by the resident labor market test so the truth is that most of these care homes and care agency they like to recruit people who are already in the uk so let's say you apply and someone else within the uk that has the experience and everything obviously they will go for the one that is already in the uk because it costs them a lot to recruit people outside the uk so anyway that is it for this care home you can go check them out with this we come to the end of today's video if you find this video informative please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like subscribe and share i'll see you guys in my next next video bye guys <music>